For the A's off the injured list today, right-hander James Caprillion. He's 5-4 and four with a 3.24 earned run average. And the batter will be Nathaniel Lowe. 1-2. and two. There's a swing. There's a line shot to left center field. On the run, Marte. He won't get it. It's in for a base hit. It bounds away from him. Garcia scores. Into second is low. And the Rangers have a 1-0 first inning lead. Here's Andy Ibanez, a right-handed hitter, batting 222 with four home runs. The 0-1 pitch now is a ground ball to the hole. It was left up with it at third is Chapman. He fires across for the out. Close play at first. Ibanez hustles down the line. Jordan Lyles on the mound, the right-hander 5-8 and eight with a 5.25 earned run average. Here recently, Jordan, uh, it didn't pitch so well his last time out against the Angels. Canna hitting 251, 11 homers, 37 RBIs for the right-handed batter. 2-2 two, two pitch, breaking ball, struck him out looking. One away in the bottom of the first with the Rangers leading 1-0. That'll bring up Starling Marte. It's Bunny. Marte can fly. How about that? How often do you see a bunt? That goes between the pitcher and the catcher, and there's no throw made to first base. Well, it just happened. That's perfect placement. So that'll bring up Olsen. Marte goes. Got him. The A's are going to take a look at it. And I don't know that Marte didn't get his left hand in there. And they call him safe. So the call is overturned and gives Starling Marte a stolen base. Out of the stretch at the belt. He takes the runner, and now here's the pitch not running, and it's outside. Olsen walks. That'll bring up Lowry. And the A's have first and second and one out. And Jett at 255 with 12 homers and 54 RBIs. And now it turns, delivers, and Jett. It's a drive and a left for a base hit. And Marte is around third up, and the ball is Martin. Here's the throw. It's going to balloon its way into the plate. Marte scores. Lowry lines a base hit to left, and the A's have tied it up at 1-1. And here's Josh Harrison. Three for nine total in the series. Hits that one toward third. And his steps on third. Throws low, and low can't dig it out. Should have been a double play. It is not, and the inning continues. So here's Murphy, a right handed hitter. Lyles delivers, and Murph hits a drive to left down the line. Base hit into the corner. Scoring is Lowry. Harrison around second, streaking to third. Gets the green light. Throw to the plate. Going to be close. The slide. It looked like Harrison was safe. Yep. It looked like he got his left hand on the plate. Safe. Three to one A's. And the A's have a three to one lead with Matt Chapman coming up. A runner at third, two balls, two strikes, two outs. Seth Brown on deck, a lefty. Pitch to Chapman. Swing and a miss. He got him to chase a high fastball to end the inning. Second strikeout for Jordan Lyles, but the Athletics answer back. They get three runs on three hits. Technically no errors, but uh, a big misplay. And one man left. After one, it's 3-1 to one open. And that'll bring up Rock Holt. Here's a 3-2 pitch and swung on a miss. Good fastball away. And Holt strikes out. Two out. First strikeout for Caprillion. That'll bring up the former Dodger, the center fielder, D.J. Peters. Two and two on the way. And that's swung on and missed. Caprillion strikes out. Peters, the inning is over. We go to the bottom of the second. It's three to one, Athletics. Brown strikes out in about a third of his official plate appearances. The count is two and two. Lyles pushes off and lets it fly. And there's a swing and a miss. High fastball got him. Brown is retired. Three punch outs now for Jordan Lyles. It's a two out rally, and Matt Olson will bat with runners at the corners. Two balls, two strikes, two outs, runners at the corners, three to one open. Second inning. Runner goes, and the pitch is blasted. Deep right field. Garcia back on the track. He has a play and makes the catch right up against the wall. Olson just got under that one, and it just barely stayed in the ballpark. And uh, Lyles escapes the inning. No runs, two hits, two left. And after two, three to one open. Adolis Garcia ready to uh, lead things off here for the Rangers who trail three to one. Here's Garcia. He swings and slaps it up the middle. Diving play to his left by Harrison. Up and over to first in time. What a play by Harrison in the shift. On the left side of second, went to his left, left his feet. In the mitt, up and over, and one pitch retires Garcia to start the fourth inning.
And here comes Nathaniel Lowe has doubled the other way in the first inning drove in the lone run so far for Texas. Nathaniel Lowe is only 26 years of age just turned 26 last month. 0 2 pitch a wave and a miss chased one outside. He's gone on strikes third K for Caprillion. And here comes Andy Abanez. The pitch to Abanez. He swings and lines at the left. Right there is Canna. Back a few strides. Reaches up. Pulls it down. An easy 1-2-3 inning for James Caprillion. On to the bottom of the fourth. And it is 3-1 Oakland. Seth Brown will start the A's bottom of the fourth inning. They lead it 3-1. 3-2. Swung on and hit a long way to right. Way back. Up. Over. And out. For Seth Brown. It's number 13 on the year. It was gone the moment he made contact. And the A's now lead it 4 to 1. Andrews lined out in the second inning. Again, the 2 2, and this is hit sharply on the ground to third. And down to his right is Hernandez. He's got it, comes up firing, and this time in the air gets it to low just in time to retire Elvis Andrews. Sharply hit ball that never really came up. It was like a Number 20. Just a worm burner there. So the bases are loaded one out, and Jed Lowry another RBI opportunity. Zeroing in on a specific location now. Three balls and a strike. Four one A's in the fourth. Base is loaded and one out the pitch. And that is inside ball four. He walks in Canada. It's 5-1 Athletics. And Jed gets his second RBI today and number 56 on the year. And it brings up Josh Harrison and Marte now at third and Josh Olsen Harrison. moves up to second. All right, so here's Harrison now one for two. And he swings and hits one on the ground to short. Izzy has a little flip to Abanez for one on to first. Double play, 6-4-3, and that will limit the damage here in the fourth inning. Yeah, and that'll bring up D.J. Peter as he struck out in the second. Okay. Two balls and two strikes. Caprillion at the belt. Turns and delivers, and that's taken. Ring him up, outside corner, fastball, perfect pitch. Peters knew it. Heads back to the dugout, two away. And that'll bring up Jason Martin, who's 0 for 1. Holtz over third, the pitch is a high pop-up, playable, back at first, foul territory. Olsen's back to the coach's box, he's there, and he makes the catch, and Caprillion works out of it. And halfway through our ball game today, after four and a half, the A's on top of the Rangers, 5 to 1. Now Matt Chapman, he has struck out and hit into a force play. Here's the pitch, swing and a miss, high fastball. And down goes Chapman. He is now 0 for 3 today as hitting woes continue. Here's Yanni Hernandez, the infield is back except at third base. The payoff pitch, high drive to center field, medium deep. Marte over into the alley to take it. The runner tags and heads home. Here comes the throw and scoring standing up is Kiner Falefa. So the Rangers get back on the board and they now trail 5-2. to two, A sacrifice fly by Yanni Hernandez. So here's Marte. Three for three and three singles. The pitch to Starling is a line drive. Base hit left center. It's six to two A's. Scoring is Canna. Marte turns it first with a single. And that's a four hit game. You can't believe the impact he's made on this club. And Matt Chapman is the batter. Chapman 0 for 3 today. He has struck out twice. 2 1 on the way. Swing and a hard hit ball to short. And that's caught by Kiner Falefa. He reached down and Kent, he caught that on the back side. Back to the top of the order for wow. Isaiah Kiner Falefa. Here's a swing and there's a long drive. Straight away left. That one's way back and that ball is history. Isaiah Connor Falefa with his seventh home run of the year. He narrows the margin to Oakland six and the Rangers three. A line smash by Connor Falefa. Last man for Trevino to try to get is DJ Peters. And he throws and it's taken. Ring him up outside corner. Strike three called and the ball game is over.